Hey Internet, what's up? Have you ever wanted to make one of those fancy videos that has the audio dub, but you just don't have a microphone? Well, I'm going to show you. For this, you're going to need a digital camera, the program DVD, Free Software Studio, and the program Audacity, which is optional. So, first what you're going to do, you're going to go to the DVD Free Software website, and I'm going to have the link in the description. And this is the website right here. You're going to click Download the Free Software Studio. And it's going to come up with this little download panel. You're going to click Open. So yeah, click that, and it's going to start downloading. Now, yours isn't going to necessarily look like mine, because I use Safari instead of uh, Internet Explorer. So, yeah, no big deal with that. Now, I've already downloaded this software, so I'm not going to go through the download process. I'm pretty sure you know how to download a program by now. So, just going to cancel that out. And when it comes up, the free software studio will look like this. It'll basically just be a big list of applications. So, what you're going to do, you're going to click Application 17, the free video to MP3 converter. And once it's downloaded, it'll look like this. So, I've already downloaded that, so I'm just going to show you how to download from this place. So, I'm going to click on any application. It'll come up with a Internet Explorer browser. You're going to click where it says Download Now. And if you're running Internet Explorer, a security thing might pop up. Just hit download file. And this will come up. Hit run. Let it download. Hit run again. Hit next. Hit next. Hit install. Let it install. You know how to install a program if you've gotten this far. And click finish. Now you don't need the internet anymore, so just close that out. Once the installation process is finished, uh, it'll automatically pop up for you, but because I closed mine out, I have to go back to it. So, your video to MP3 converter is going to look like this. What you're going to do is you're going to click Browse to find the video file that you want the audio from. So, go to the folder where you have it. Mine happens to be in the desktop, so I'm just going to get the audio from my recent sword fight video click open it'll show the length right there, that's 25, 29 seconds then you're gonna click browse where it says output folder you want it to be in a place where you can find it later so I'm gonna put mine on the desktop and click OK then you hit convert and it'll start extracting the audio from it it'll be a pretty fast process if your videos um short so click close, close that out close the internet Oh, this was the program that I downloaded, don't need that. And the MP3 for my sword fight video is right here. Yeah, all blue and highlighted. So feel free to test that out. See if it sounds to your liking. Yeah, this is pretty alright, pretty good. So, just close that out. But however, if you do not like the audio for your video, you're going to need the program Audacity to, uh, to edit the audio. So this is what Audacity looks like. It's an awesome program. You can like change the pitch, change the tone, all that good stuff. And I'm going to show you how to get this program as well. So let me just minimize this. Go back to the internet. And go to the Audacity website. I'll have that also posted in the description. So you're going to click Download Audacity 1.2.6 and you're going to click where it says Audacity 1.2.6 installer. So click that, another download panel will come up, click open. Again, I already have this so I'm just going to exit that out. Now go back to the page you were on and I suggest getting these optional downloads because it makes Audacity better, it gives it more effects lets you convert to mp3s, all that good stuff. And once you have that, feel free to open Audacity, uh, drag your audio file into it. You can just drag or drop or go to Project, Import Audio, find your song, all that good stuff. And it'll show you what it looks like in these sound waves. And yeah, it's pretty cool. 
like I said, you can um, you can change the pitch, change tempo, speed, add effects, bass booster, all that stuff. I mean, yeah. Check this out. I'm a chipmunk. No, I'm Barry Manilow. And once you're done with that, just click File, Export as MP3, put a name on it, it'll export to the desktop or somewhere. And once you're done with that, just drag and drop your audio file into whatever video editing program you're using. I'm using Windows Movie Maker, and here's the audio file you just saw. And you're going to have your video there, your audio there, put those on the timeline, line them up, and you've got an audio dub.